All right. Hello, everyone. Hello. We are back with story now for sure this time. Uh, we are going to fly <laughs> over, beat up a Scalder, and then uh, we're going to do the uh, Scarlet Onslaught. I'll try not to go in that building. If you guys remember, in Dragon Blight, we actually did a little bit of stuff with the Scarlet Onslaught down here in New Hearthclin. Um, that we we pretty much wiped out that group of uh, of Scarlet people. This is like the last set of them that exist in Northrend up here. Uh, we're gonna be going over to fight them and do their quest chain. Um, and it's actually a pretty decent one. You find out some stuff about the Scarlet uh, onslaught that uh, you didn't already know. So don't forget, we have those runes that will like. Look, increase. I will forget that. Okay. Well, I just told you. No, I already forgot. What did you, you say? I just told you. You're a fucking loser. Where is... Oh, up here. Okay. Alright, so what we gotta do for this quest... Remember, the plan is to have the Banshee... Uh, is to have the Banshee take over Iskaldur's body, and then we're gonna kill Iskaldur after challenging him to combat. No, fight me! Oh, that's actually you. Uh, he said Miro. Yeah, it's you who voices him because it's the Banshee. Oh. And her. Scalder, there you are. What is this? Engaged in battle already? Who's that? Very well. Finish these lesser beings and let us be about our business. Oh, it's a Valky. Yeah, and there's a Lady Banshee inside this dude, so. Well, I think he's still a guy considering how he's grunting. No. Let's just stock noises. Wait, if a banshee's inside him, why is he even fighting back? Uh, to make it look good. No! How is this possible? I know not how this was possible, but you must still be judged, Discolder. Wait, what is this? That was the worst acting ever. <laughs> this? This is me taking control of you. This is me setting up my final revenge. Stay away from me, creature. Do not touch me. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> it is done. Return to my cave. We have much to discuss. You're the worst. <laughs> As of today, I am no longer streaming with Wendy. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Oops, I'm being attacked. You're probably the biggest loser. No! That Valky is flying around. That's what she does. Oh wait, she's a rare! Hey, fight her. Yeah, let's fight her. No! I was like, why is she flying around? One thing I like about WoW over FF14, if I use an attack on my, uh... Shit, I can't actually hit this girl, so I can't interrupt her. She's floating just out of my range. Well, that's shit. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Valkyr Vestiments of the Fire Lash. No, I don't want to. Abandoned Adventurer Satchel. Okay. I didn't get a satchel. Oh, yeah, I did. Okay, cool. Anyway, um. Packing. Here goes with the Ah. We're going in here. She says. I put Vardmadra aside for the moment. She's someplace safe until we can enact our final revenge. Time has come, Luminol and Miro. You and your friends must challenge the Lord of Belagard Fortress, the Master of Jotunheim, Overthame Belagard. Atop the fortress, which is on the southwestern edge of Jotunheim, you will find a horn. Blow into it. Allow your challenge to resound throughout the steadfast. 
Olegard will have no choice but to face you, and I, excuse me, Guard Madra will be there to adj adjudicate the challenge. Banshee possessed Frigal, it's not a bellowing cackle. Okay. So yeah, we get to go fight that person. Over thing. I don't know what it is, but this guy upstairs, like, today, you know, something around. Turning this quest on the way? What quest on the way? The Fleshworks? Or no, the Onslaught? No, that's uh, gonna lead us down uh, into the Onslaught. Okay, okay. We will do that after. It's <sighs> fine. First, we're gonna fly to this Vrykil castle here. This is where we fight Overthane Balagard. As you can see, the Vavarka builds a pretty cool castles. Do you have any plans today? Uh, I have all the plans. Huh. Uh, no, why? Is he up on top? Of course he is. I'm gonna blow the horn. Alright, I'm but there's the no horn, horn here. Here she comes. He's on his way. Well. Where? Get up here with me. How'd you blow a horn? It's right there. Oh, that. Oh. You dare to challenge me? Yes. You haven't earned the right. Wrong, Balagard. You will accept this challenge. But Mardra, did the Lich King send you personally? Very well. I will dispatch these creatures. It is only an inconvenience. Prepare to die! Thorum used this model when he was first in the game. Yeah, that's pretty funny, because it's like nothing... Nothing alike, really. What the fuck is... Why does he have like... A forever cast on that. Yikes, they're actually pretty hard. Well, you're not supposed to stand in it. Well, I thought maybe I could get some hints in. Spell reflect, bitch. Oh, you got a lot of health. Alright, it'll take a while. Let them feel the chill of Ice Crown! That's gonna make it take even longer, though. The giant's breath? No, him spinning. Uh, yes. Oh, hello. Oh, God. Stay where you are. Bard Madra, I wondered where you disappeared to. How is Iskal there? But 
nothing. Finish them. Do not fail me, Belagar. He just calmly shows away. All right. All right. Die, dogs. Okay. So he's just gonna say this and spin. I thought he called us Torgs. Oh no, I'm snared in it. Lich King is just like watching. I thought he would go away, but no. He's like, I'll watch you do this. Stay there? That's fine. What? <laughs> just like zoomed over to me. Now we know why this is a three person quest. It's a five person quest. Oh. Yeah, that makes more sense. We are five people. We do have a job. And. Uh, bubble say. Yeah, that's right. Any plans today? You yeah, asked that. Oh, I did? Yeah, I said no. What more do you want? I'm oh, sorry. I only answer questions once. Well, you answered it twice. Well, I didn't. No. Oh, he's coming back. Did one of my finest, but your efforts are for naught. Wait, don't you have way stronger in the Citadel? The frozen heart of Ice Crown awaits. Alright. So yeah. Okay. That's a thing. Back to Yoltenheim. Ah, uh, yeah, well, yeah, we're gonna turn the quest with the first, uh, with the Bone Witch, who should actually be dead now, <laughs> technically. Oh, uh, she said Lady Knights with smiles and flies off to return to possessing the Bone Witch. Oh, fair enough. I don't know how she would have managed to escape the Lich King, but alright, I'll take it. Yeah. Oh, well. Despite my, li my favorite character in this series being the Lich King, I do feel like this expansion just had him do everything half-ass. He didn't full-ass anything except for his fight with you, and even then, they decided to make him half-ass by sucking against Tyrion. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't want any of these. Go ahead and read it. Oh, fuck. I skipped it. Of course you did. Words cannot describe what I'm feeling at the moment, Miro. My revenge is complete, and there is not else for me to do. If only I could be aware uh, there when the Lich King is finally taken down. Don't fool yourself, though. Jotunheim is far from dealt with. I will remain in possession of this witch until such time as the Vrykula are no longer a threat. Look around. There are many items of value in this cave. Take your pick. Couldn't give me any of these before, huh? Is my weapon like the max I can get it to? No, I can upgrade it again. Alright. I'm gonna have to do that. Anyway, I see and hear many things, Mira. Oh, that's you. Oh. 
Um, Is this the daily? I see in here many things, Luminol and Miro, and something very important has happened since your defeat of Overthane Balagur. You are wanted for battle in Valhallas. You will find the battle pit to the north. Go now with your friends and speak with Jerry the Valkyar. The challengers that she will offer you within Valhallas are sure to require their help. Good luck. Okay, well, let's go do the house. Off we go then. You haven't, you haven't moved. I did move, just the wrong direction. You were a little wrong. You know, there's no time. If that were true, you'd be going in the right direction. Hey, Pop. Hello. Pop, I think we discussed this before. Why would you want to be known as Skinny Penis? What? He's like, hey, it's your boy, Skinny Penis. Huh? That's what he said. That's pretty weird. Why can't I talk to this person? You say I have to be close, how close do they want me to be? Alright, I'm gonna float up then. There we go, okay. This is a lady. This is ridiculous. Right? You have bested our finest warriors. Your name is renowned Luminol. Also Miro. Perhaps you think that this concerns me. It does not. If they can fall to you, then they are not worthy, and should be nothing but lowly Vargul. But perhaps I can give you and your friends different sport. Valhallas is also a place of combat of all types with many different kinds of foes. Speak to me again when you and your friends are ready to proceed. We shall see if you are truly worthy. Alright. If you believe yourself ready to begin, then I have just the match for you to cut your teeth on. Another group of outsiders thought themselves prepared for the rigors of Valhallas. They had much hubris, but in the end they fell like all the others. If you think yourself so different, if you think that you have the skill and experience to fight here amongst such storied warriors, then please accept the challenge. Sure. Another five person quest. Anyway, Pop says, it's a Vine quote. Yeah, but I don't watch Vines, so you've made it your own. Vine is dead, isn't that? I have no idea. I don't know anything about Vine. Oh, yeah, it at least that. died for a while. How? Ah, uh, here we are. Which one do you want to take out first? Okay. Right. Oh, you're the weak one. That's hard. We've talked about this. It's true, Pop. Anyway, how's your weekend going, Pop? What you up to? What games you been playing? Hey, you have DPS me. I usually do. No. Yeah, I'm using superiority in every way. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to talk to this guy. Uh uh. Wow, the crowd can shut up already. I need something. New blood. The Vikil Death Knight spits on the ground at your feet. You think that you have what it takes to fight here? You are nothing before the might of the Vikil and the Scourge. Still, you did manage to defeat six incompetent corpses, so you must have some skill in you. Not likely enough for the next challenge, though. Leave me be. Alright, here we go. 
variety of beings travel the world to prove themselves within Valhallas. Some even come from under the world. Kithrix, the Dark Master, is one such. Hailing from deep within the ground where insanity reigns, Kithrix has asked for someone exotic to face in the ring. You will do. Dare you face this Nerubian nightmare, Blood Elf? I knew it would be one of those spiders. Yeah. That name. Kithrix. You know what you say. I should say, Luminol has accepted the challenge of Kithrix the Dark Master. May the gods show mercy upon her, for Kithrix surely will not. I don't even look like this, too. When I am done here, I'm going to mount your heads upon the walls of Ashdel Narub. I'm going to try and spell our point. Ah, fair. The Dark Master has been defeated by Nero and her band of companions. Let the next challenge be issued. You've been playing Enter the Gungeon, Overwatch, and modded Minecraft. What kind of mods do you use in Minecraft? Make it quick. You want me to be impressed by the fact that you and your friends are able to bring down a lone Nerubian priest? Get out of my sight before I summon my ghouls upon you. Oh, that'd be great, do that. <sighs> oh, he was a priest. An old foe of yours has returned, Sigrid Iceborne. Perhaps you remember besting her in a duel upon the Savage Ledge? No matter, she certainly remembers you. She's insisting upon a chance to prove herself once more. Personally, I think it's more a chance for revenge, but that too can be useful in this place. I'll leave it up to you, Luminol and Miro. Will you face Sigrid Iceborne once more? Yes. Yeah. I can hear Sigrid Iceborne approaching from the northwest. She has been informed that she cannot use her proto drake in battle gear. Do not leave the battle ring. Sigrid Iceborne has returned to the heights of Jotunheim to prove herself against Miro. Uh, when last they met, Miro vested her in personal combat. Let's see the outcome of this match. Oh, there you are. Remember me? Of course you do. Wait right here. I'm coming down. <laughs> you are the worst. What? <laughs> no effort into it. That was effort. You don't know. I'll tell you that for free. Oh, alright. That's rude. Many mods, but you mainly do Astral Sorcery? What's Astral Sorcery? Now keep in mind, I don't really play any Minecraft. Dragon Quest Builders is the closest thing I do for it. Do you not jump back? That's really nice. Look over there. Is that your Zen thing? Yeah. 
Actually, it's actually super hard. Yeah, yeah it does. I guess she does have a little bit of strength there. Damn it, I tried to hit that. It is called Flash Face. I don't think it's Sunnable. If I just fight her from range, it should be fine. She throws shit at me. That's actually kind of convenient. Wait, how did that hit me? That means from big range. Most dead though. It's weird. Right. I tried taunting her, and she's like, "I'm not going for it." Miro has defeated Sigrid Iceborne for a second time. Well, this time she did it with the help of her friend. But a win is a win. What? You did it last time with the help of a friend. It's like a star mod. It has a lot to do with the stars. Okay. You're bored. Save you. Well, I can't do that. I can give you well, entertaining... Well, your stream is here, but... <laughs> it's true. Yes. The defeat of one of the Hildener is mildly impressive. Blood Elf, but you will have to do better, or you will have to help. But you did have the help of your friends. You're lucky that her Drake didn't get involved. Ah, uh, fuck Tomorrow yourself. Never impress uh, uh, in that guy. Alright. You have been successful up to this point, Luminol and Miro, but what you must fight us to continue to battle within Valhalla is a gigantic horror beyond imagining. I must warn you to turn away now. Carnage is a mountain of flesh constructed by the Lich King's most fiendish minds. I do not see how you and your friends will defeat it. However, the choice is yours. Yes. Carnage is coming. Remember, no matter what you do, do not leave the battle ring or I disqualify you and your group. From the bowels of the Underhalls comes Carnage. Brave and foolish Miro and Luminol have accepted the challenge. She and her friends stand ready to face the monstrosity. You've played Monster Hunter much? Do you play it on the PC or the PS4? Or the Switch if you're playing Monster Hunter Cross. I expect this hit, this fuck to hit hard. Yeah. Usually big enemy too, but we shall see. Oh, I'm stunned. So there's that. Yeah, it does a stomp on me too. It wasn't much. I cannot stun him. so far. Yeah, he's been pretty weak. Turn away, this is too strong. Yeah, I'm running. No. Leave one out, then it's just gonna play yourself. No, it says if you leave it will disqualify everyone. Already battling in Valhallas? Doesn't that mean we're worthy of battle here? What? I'm starting to respect your prowess in the ring, Miro. Luminol. Now I really don't like you. 
I would much rather have preferred to see you and your friends stuck to the bottom of that flesh giant's boot. PS4 was on sale and you're saving? Hey, we will that's wreck. nothing wrong with that. Grabbing things on sale, this was, that's something of what I do. I got Persona 5 on sale for 50 bucks. Your skills have not gone unnoticed by the wrinkle of Jotunheim Luminolimero. Thane Banahog has taken a personal interest in you and has insisted that he be our next match. If you thought Carnage was bad, but you didn't, then you might want to go home now. Thane Banahog's nickname is the Death Blow. I think you can guess how he earned it. You accept the Thane's challenge. Look to the southeast and you will see the Thane upon the platform near Yonor the Merciless when he shows himself. Let him come down, stay within the ring of Valhallas. Thane Banahog returns to Valhallas for the first time in ages to prove that the Reiko are the only beings worthy to fight within its sacred ring. The Luminal Amira proves wrong. Enough! You tiny insects are not worth the worthy to do battle in this sacred place. You do not fight with honor. You do not even ascend. Fight me and die, you cowards. Technically, I do have ascend. I guess that's true. Yeah, he does hit a lot harder than the other guy. Oh, he punted me. I did. Wait, ascend. That's. Astrologians in the 14. Never mind. I do have Transcend. This guy's tough. He hits hard, but he's not too strong. He's not as tough as he thinks he is. No one ever is. Trouble is. Tonight I'm probably gonna try and get uh, the second level of my paladin weapon from Eureka, and that's that's it. Okay. I'm gonna get six more light because they brought the light thing back. Ah. Uh, Look how big Mirror is now. It's way bigger. Why is he standing yeah, on my I head? I can get bigger. Look. I'm the same size. Dame Banahog, the death blow has fallen to Miro and her fighting companion. She has but one challenge ahead of her. Who will it be? Speak your peace. I do not know what trickery it is that you use to bring down the Thane. I couldn't see it from this angle. But I can assure you that you will not survive your next match. Yes, I know who it is. Run, little blood elf. Flee to the far corners of the world. Or stay and die. It matters little to me. Suffer well. It's the Lich King. That's pretty awesome. I'm afraid that your success is going to be your undoing, Luminal Amiro. If the Valkyrie could turn more white, she would. Word of your success in Valhallis has reached deep into Ice Crown Citadel, stirring one whom you have no desire to meet. Prince Sandoval himself is on his way at this very moment. Jonar warned you that you should run, and I cannot disagree. What will you do? He's on his way. Will you face the Blood Prince in final battle? This is one of PMS' favorite uh, things. It's too late to run now. Do not leave the ring. Die bravely, Luminol and Miro. From the depths of Ice Crown Citadel, one of the Lich King's chosen comes to put an end to the existence of Luminol and her friend. 
Warriors of Jotunheim I present to you, Blood Prince Sandoval. Hardly a fitting introduction, Spearwife. Now, who is this outsider I've been hearing so much about? I will make this as easy as possible for you. Simply come here and die. That is all that I ask for your many trespasses. For your selling of this exalted place of battle. For your effrontery to the Lich King! This guy is one of the San Leon. He's a very powerful, uh, basically undead blood elf. Blood elf vampire. Yeah, they're basically vampires. And he is kicking my ass. He actually does hit like a fucking truck. Dual wields, too. That's kind of cool. Fire shield. Oh, this is painful. Wow. Yeah, that was really painful. I'm not sure how you're supposed to deal with that. What? Oh, gosh. Uh, can we just like run away? Use cooldowns. Alright, well, this is significantly less painful over here. Alright, run the fuck away! Okay. Yeah, like one or two of them might fly over and hit us over here, but for the most part, that's uh, a lot easier to survive when we don't get hit by it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm gonna drag him over here just so we have more space to run around. It'd be great if he'd stop using it every couple seconds, though. Alright. He jinxed it. It is. We got 12% off from of that time before he did it again, at least. to see how much damage difference it made. Oh, 
The unthinkable has happened. Mira has slain Prince Sandoval. In defeating him, she and her fighting companion have proved themselves worthy of battle in this most sacred place of great call on Earth. All hail Miro and Luminal, champions of Valhalla's. Your defeat of Prince Sandoval sickens me. An unwashed peasant such as yourself should have willingly given her life simply for the chance to meet him and kneel at his feet. You've earned your damned reward. Be quick about your choosing. There's oh, work to be done. I, I get one thing. Like, there's no choosing there. I got one option. It's not even upgrades. I've disenchanted in front of his face. Yeah, mine's not even an upgrade either. Alright. Yeah. So we're going to stop our recording here. So that was really good. We got the uh, Valhalla stuff done.